The only crime that I have committed is to fearlessly defend our nation from those who seek to destroy it. New at 10, former President Donald Trump speaking to supporters at Mar-a-Lago after an historic day in court in Manhattan. Trump now faces 34 felony charges. He is the first former president to be charged with a crime. As Melissa Adon explains tonight, Trump maintains his innocence. An unprecedented day in American history has concluded as former President Donald Trump, who was once again seeking to become commander in chief, currently has a new title, criminal defendant. Inside Mar-a-Lago, Trump addressing the arraignment in New York State Supreme Court. I never thought anything like this could happen in America. Never thought it could happen. The former president pleading not guilty to 34 state felony charges that he repeatedly and fraudulently falsified New York business records to conceal criminal conduct that hid damaging information from the voting public during the 2016 presidential election. Trump reacting to those charges. The only crime that I have committed is to fearlessly defend our nation from those who seek to destroy it. He traveled back to Florida immediately after his court appearance, <laughs> greeted by some supporters on his return. Prosecutors allege Trump orchestrated a criminal scheme with his former lawyer and fixer Michael Cohen and his friend, former National Enquirer publisher David Pecker, to pay hush money to at least three people, including porn actress Stormy Daniels. A catch and kill scheme. That is a scheme to buy and suppress negative information to help Mr. Trump's chance of winning the election. The former president's lawyers insisting this is a political persecution. While everyone is not above the law, no one's below it either. And if this man's name was not Donald J. Trump, there is no scenario we'd all be here today. Please understand that based on these charges. That's Melissa Don reporting Trump's next court date not until December 4th. His trial not expected to begin until January and it could run through the election year.